Hi there, Libra, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of September at the um, 14th through to the 20th. I went ahead, shuffled the carpets, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Libra. First up, we have the Eight of Wands in the upright, followed then by the Ace of Wands upright. And next we have the Four of Wands in the upright with the Ace of Pentacles upright and the King of Swords in the upright position. What's going on here, Libra, for your overall energy? Lots of excitement in the air. There's lots of movement. There's lots of things going on for Libra. It's going to be a fast-paced week for you. Lots of communication coming in. This could be arrows of love. Find their mark. Some of you could be getting a lot of text messages, if you, especially if you're on the dating sites. This could be a lot of people messaging you and um, wanting to date you, Libra. This could be for some of you, uh, if you're good news if you're in business for yourself. It's going to be a lot of orders coming in, keeping you very, very busy this week, um, Libra. For others of you, this could just be uh, lots of communication happening back and forth. Maybe you put out your resume and you're getting a lot of um, a lot of interest coming back towards you. A lot of back and forth information, a lot of, uh, it could be travel because the wands do govern travel as well. So maybe for some of you, you're making travel plans this week. Uh, perhaps, especially if you're dating someone who's at a distance, maybe they're making plans to come and visit you. Maybe you're making plans to go visit them. Whatever the situation is, lots of plans, lots of activity, lots of movement this week. Very busy week coming right at the beginning of the week. This There's a new excitement in the air here, a Libra, for you. The Ace of Wands represents, well, all Aces bring in, usher in something new. Um, in this reading, you have two Aces. There's definitely something new on the horizon for you. Um, a new lease on life for some of you. The Ace of Wands can represent uh, passion returning to a relationship or a situation that lost its, its passion. Sometimes this can be the passion returning. Sometimes we work, especially... If we have our own business or we work in a, a career that we really love, sometimes it can get stale after a while and we kind of lose interest. But this is where the interest returns. It can be even in a relationship. Relationships can sometimes go uh, south in the sense that they're, they become stale and, and uninteresting. So this is where the, the passion returns again. For others of you, this could be a new opportunity, an opportunity to travel, yes. <clears throat> It could be an opportunity to build something new. A new project is in the works and perhaps you're working on that and you couldn't be more excited about it. This could be a new idea that comes out of the anti-cosmos for you to get moving towards. This is all about movement. Remember, wands govern action, activity, movement, and, um, and sometimes uh, travel. So... Maybe it's an opportunity for some of you to travel. Maybe some of you landed a job that involves travel or you're putting together some kind of travel package. Whatever the situation is, there's movement, there's passion, there's an excitement in the air. It could be a new relationship for some of you. It could be a new uh, job or career for some of you. And the, the progression is going to move quite quickly with the Four of Wands following it. Because remember in the story of the tarot, the first, the Ace of Wands is the first one. The second one is uh, where we're building towards it. And then we finally get to the summit is the Four of Wands. So it could be some fast movement where if you've got, say, travel plans in the work, they, works, they could uh, play out very quickly to the point where you make the plans and then all of a sudden, boom, you're gone. Because there's a lot of fast activity going on here in terms of movement. And <clears throat> for some of you, <clears throat> the Four of Wands could represent a new home. Uh, the Four of Wands is such a beautiful energy. It's one of the best in the uh, Minor Arcana. So this could represent some of you perhaps or uh, building a new home or some of you are renovating a new home and it's finally being finished. Others of you could be looking at an engagement. You could be looking at a wedding or going to a wedding or putting together a wedding. There's something going on, could be involving family and other people, other friends. 
that this could be an, a completion of something that you a project that you've been working at for a while and it's finally ready for its big reveal you know such as in if we've been building a home and then finally we're able it's finished and we're able to have that housewarming party you know let's all get together and see the results of this project finally being completed it's a summit we're not finished completely but we have reached a certain milestone could be in a relationship we're building a relationship to the point where there's something more solid could be getting married could be moving in together getting engaged that kind of thing beautiful energy and fast moving stuff this could be moving very very quickly for you <clears throat> especially at the beginning of the week remember jupiter is, is now moving in forward motion a lot of the things that have been stuck and stalled uh, in the the previous months over the summer are in um in north america anyway it was summer it could be that things are starting to vamp up now they're starting to move super quick now we move on towards the weekend we do see another ace here this time it's the ace of pentacles in the upright the ace of pentacles new beginnings in what this could be something solid you could have built something here libra whether it's a relationship or whether it's a um a business situation or what have you or a career you've built something really solid and this could be the the new beginnings of that some of you could be investing you could be investing in yourself investing in your own future your own career your own business you some of you could be investing getting a great investment opportunity maybe someone is uh is bringing you in on an investment where here if you know you invest a little bit of money this could be paying big dividends down the road for others of you maybe you found an ideal apartment or a home that um especially if it's a home to purchase it could be worth a lot of money someday uh, others of you could have just found you know the or somebody maybe gifted you the perfect place to live or things like that could be even a gift of, of finances or a material uh, item maybe somebody is um because this can sometimes represent inheriting something material such as a material item or it could be actual finances could be somebody <coughs> actually giving you some money because of you know for whatever reason remember just take what applies to you don't try to make it fit if it doesn't fit i'm reading for thousands of different people different scenarios so if it's not your reading, you'll know. If it is, it'll resonate for you. And if it's not, try checking out your um, your moon sign or your rising sign, and that may be more of a fit for this week. And the last card you have is the King of Swords in the upright position. Well, this is a court card, could be representing a person. If it's representing a person, this is air energy, that of Gemini, Libra, like yourself, or Aquarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising, male or female. Could be for some of you, Perhaps that's where the gift is coming from. Maybe it's from this person. The King of Swords could be representative of uh, a friend, a spouse, a family member, or somebody who perhaps is gifting you some cash. It could be also a lawyer because sometimes the King of Swords can represent a legal representative. Good news for any of you who are going through a court case or court battle right now. It could be at the end of the week you get some good news from your lawyer or from the courts. Um, this is also good news for anybody who has had arbitration going on. Um, military could be seeing the return of a military person in your life if this is a spouse or a family member. Good news if this is you just coming up in your own reading in the upright position. You're on the right track here, Libra. This could just be you fully embodying and showing the best of you. Um, in the King of Swords energy, the King of Swords shoots from the hip, knows exactly how to explain himself. Uh, you could be feeling like King of the Hill. I could see that with his reading. This is a fantastic reading here, Libra. You've got lots of excitement coming, lots of movement. Everything is on track and it's moving so beautifully for you. What a great reading. I hope it helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.